how to apply for jobs in people per hour. Hello and welcome to our channel. On this video, I'm going to show you how you can apply for jobs in people per hour. So please watch till the end to properly understand the tutorial. And to create an account on people per hour, you could also use my affiliate link below the description where I earn a small commission at no additional cost to you. And by using the link, you may also get some discount or rewards upon sign up. But before that, if you don't know what is this people per hour platform, it is an online freelancing platform that connects clients with skilled freelancers across various fields, allowing businesses to hire talent on an hourly or project basis. And the platform facilitates a streamlined process where clients can post projects detailing their needs and freelancers can respond with tailored proposals. Utilizing an artificial intelligence system, people per hour matches clients with suitable freelancers ensuring a diverse selection of skills and expertise is available. And now to create an account on people per hour, you could simply click the login button or the sign up button on the top right corner, in which upon clicking on it, will automatically be directed on this page. And from here, just choose, I want to work as a freelancer. By clicking this one, all you need to do is to simply sign up using your Facebook or email account in here. Upon clicking this sign up with email, all you need to do is to simply fill out all of this required information to sign up such as your first name, last name, email address, and to generate your own password in here. And after filling out all of this required information, just click the sign up button to proceed. Then you will now be able to be directed on this page, and it will show you on this pop-up window that you need to check your inboxes for the verification code that has been sent to your email. And by clicking this activate account button, you will be able to be directed in here, in which all you need to do is to simply submit some of the requirements to complete your profile in here, such as your profile picture, to choose your job title, your location, language, and many more. And you could also customize to enter here your hourly rate in here. And let's say you've now successfully create your account as a freelancer. You can now click the search button on the top right corner and click search projects button. And upon clicking on it, you'll be able to see here all of the results of projects or freelance jobs that you could also apply to. And as you can see here at this point, some of these projects are currently random and aside from that, on the top panel, you could also navigate some other services. Or if you're looking for a specific freelancer, web your AI services, technology and programming, writing, translation, design, design marketing, and many more. In which each category on the top panel, it will show us in here the subcategory below. So by simply choosing any of this category, you can simply choose or look for a specific freelancer that will do the job that you're looking for. However, to search for a specific project or job in here, you can click or choose by entering here on the search bar the kind of project that you're looking for. For example, I'm going to enter here data entry and upon clicking the search button, it will show in here all of the results about data entry projects. We'll be able to see here the short description and also the hourly rate or the fixed rate offer on a specific project. And below here, you could also see the number of days it has been posted and the number of proposal that has been sent to this project. And as you can see here, some of the project has badge on an opportunity, which means that this kind of project will make you or will give you a high value income. However, it is not 100% accurate in here, since it just depends on the amount that is offered. And now you can simply scroll down in here to look for a specific project. And from here, if you click this add to favorite jobs, it will show you on your list of your favorite job offer that you can apply anytime you want. However, if you want to apply now, can you proceed by clicking the offer right here? And it will show you all of the description about the job and the number of people that has been sent a proposal on this job. It will also show you the ending days of submitting a proposal, the fixed rate in here, which is 33 euros or approximately $37. And below it will show you all of the qualifications that are needed in order to get hired or apply to this job. While on the right side panel, it will show you the person that posts this kind of job proposal. And below, you could simply click the apply now button to proceed. However, you could also consider the amount or the data including the projects awarded, the date of its last project, or some of the freelancers it has been worked with, since it is important to avoid a scam in here. And below, it will show you all of the clarification board or some of the question that has been raised by other user in here that you want to apply to this specific job. And now to proceed applying for this job, just click the apply now button and upon clicking on it, we will be directed in here since all we need to do to submit application is to simply again complete the profile details in here. However, if you're now done completing all of this record information, you can now proceed by submitting your cover letter in here or your resume 
Or alternatively, you could also use, for example, using ChatGPT by simply copying all of this description. And you could also command ChatGPT to create your own cover title or cover letter in here, such as resume, with the corresponding requirements. And also, you also need to make sure that the cover letter that you will send will be fit to the job that they're looking for. And as you can see, I'm going to enter here, create a resume that fit for the job with this requirement. And after that, you'll now be able to see here the format that you could also use as your cover letter that will be sent to the employer. You could also see here all of the lists of skills that you need to have, the education background, and many more that will be helpful in order to apply for this job. But if you have other concern or question, you can simply click this ask a question button in which the question that you will be able to ask will automatically proceed to this clarification board below when the employer can just answering your question below. However, you firstly need to complete your freelancer application to proceed. And now aside from that, if you're looking for a specific kind of project, aside from using the search bar on the top panel, you could also use this filters option right here by simply clicking this filter button. It will show us on the left side panel some of the filters including the experience if you're looking for a specific entry level and also the location such as remote project only and even what kind of project type in here. And aside from that, you could also navigate to choose either fix or per hour price. And after that, you will be able to see all of the results of that job posting with a given qualification or requirements to the kind of filters that you just set up in here. In front of here, you can simply click this add to favorites icon in here to start adding it to your favorites and apply for this job in the future. And aside from filter that you could also use in finding a specific job with the filters on, you could also use this relevance in here by clicking this one. You can choose either all this or the latest job posting that has been posted in here. And it will show you all of this latest result that you can start applying in here. And before you start applying for a specific job in here, you also need to make sure that you also set up your profile on this platform in order to secure the jobs that you're applying for. And you could also use on the top panel some of the services to look for a specific freelancer that you could also use that you can use their profile info as your guide in creating your own. Since a well-crafted profile serves as a primary marketing tool showcasing a freelancer's skills, experience, and personality to potential clients. And it is essential to fill out every section of the profile including a professional introduction, a clear profile picture, and a detailed list of skills in which this information not only helps in attracting clients but also aids people per our AI matching system connecting freelancers with suitable job opportunities. And now let's say we're going to change the kind of project or job that we're looking for but at this point I'm going to search for content writing. And by clicking on it, it will show us below here all of their sold of projects and start applying it depending on your preferences. And aside from that to look for a specific project, you could also use this all categories button. And by clicking here, it will show us a variety of categories that we can choose from. But overall, that is just basically how you can apply for jobs in people per hour. Thank you.